You would never guess it by looking at them, but elephant shrews are more closely related to elephants than shrews. Elephant shrews are small, furry mammals that resemble giant mice or gerbils. In spite of their name, they are not actually shrews, and despite their appearance, they are not rodents either. Elephant shrews are most closely related to moles and tenrecs. Elephant shrews can jump three feet into the air, giving them the nickname, Jumping Shrew. They are known to thrive in the Namib Desert, which is one of the driest places in the world. Elephant shrews are only found in Africa. Female elephant shrews menstruate similarly to human females. Elephant shrews can live up to four years and are ready to reproduce at six weeks old. These shrews are quite small and typically only grow to be 4 to 12 inches in length, not counting their tails. An elephant shrew's tail can grow up to 9 inches in length. The largest species of this shrew can weigh up to 1.5 pounds, but most species weigh less than a pound. To put this in perspective, this means that the average elephant shrew weighs about as much as a large can of soup. In general, these shrews have short, stiff, and glossy fur similar to rodents like mice and their coloring often depends on the species. They can sport black, gray, brown, white, tan, or golden fur, and certain species have a checkered coat with multiple colors. They have scaly tails, powerful hind legs, long feet, and long, thin snouts that are similar enough to an elephant's trunk to give them their colloquial name. Their long, flexible snouts, along with their large eyes and ears, allow them to hunt for insects and escape predators. Their long hind legs allow them to jump up to three feet in the air, similarly to rabbits, and this is where the nickname, Jumping Shrew, comes from. These shrews are extremely active and considered diurnal, which means they sleep at night and are awake during the day. These shrews belong to a special group of mammals known as Afrotheria, which means that they are of African origin. They can be seen in zoos, but they only live in the wilds of Africa. In particular, they can be found in the stone deserts, savannas, and arid steppes of the continent. In fact, they are known to thrive in the Namib Desert, which is famous for being one of the driest places in the world. They can also be found in the tropical forests of East Africa as well. These animals are primarily insectivores, but they may also eat leaves, fruits, and seeds. Ants, termites, worms, spiders, centipedes, and millipedes are their diet of choice. They use their proboscis-like noses together with their paws to clear away small paths on the ground in order to lure insects close. They have exceptional senses of sight, hearing, and smell, and this helps them to both searches for food and escape predators. These shrews have long, skinny tongues like an anteater, and this helps them to hunt and eat insects more easily. Because they are so small, these shrews face a number of predators, including snakes, lizards, and various birds of prey. While it's also true that any carnivorous or omnivorous type of animal would prey upon the little elephant shrew, the truth is that they are difficult to catch. These shrews are well adapted to their habitats. Not only are they masterfully camouflaged by their coloring, but they are also very speedy and nimble. Most elephant shrews can run up to 18 miles per hour and leap 3 feet into the air. More than predators, the biggest threat to the shrew comes from the loss of habitat. Deforestation and the habitat fragmentation that comes with agriculture and logging both have had a devastating impact on the elephant shrew population. They are listed as not extinct, but their conservation status is generally considered endangered. The two species of these shrews that are considered the most threatened are the gray-faced sangi, which was only discovered in 2005, and the golden-rumped elephant shrew, which is officially listed as endangered. These animals have relatively short lifespans, so they reach sexual maturity at an early age. Most elephant shrews live only two years in the wild and up to four years in captivity. One unusual trait of these shrews is that the females have menstrual cycles that are very similar to those of human females. Most mammals are only sexually viable during certain times of the year, so frequent menstruation means that they are able to birth multiple litters annually. Another uncommon trait is that elephant shrews mate for life, and these couples fiercely defend their territory. Gestation ranges from 45 to 60 days, and a typical healthy litter contains no more than three babies. It is common for female shrews to give birth to only one or two babies at a time. Babies are weaned from their mothers within a week of birth, 
and they are ready to explore their surroundings and migrate away from the nest by day 15. After about 45 days, the young elephant shrews will become sexually active and establish their own nests far away from their parents.